you've got the will and the desire and put the motivation in and a focus, things tend to happen. There is one great truth on this planet. Whoever you are, or whatever it is that you do, when you really want something, it's because that desire originated in the soul of the universe. What does it take to have success last? What does it take to make a change last? Well, the first thing you need is this focus where you know what you want and why you want it and you're driven and you're hungry and you're committed and you got all your energy into it. There's opportunity every day, every day that we wake up, we open our eyes and we have command of our faculties, wake up in our right mind. There is the ability to go after and do anything. So the reason why people don't put action behind their work and, and, and their thought process and, 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 and what they're saying is because they lose the motivation. They lose that fire inside to keep the engines running through those hurdles of life, adversity, and, and they get shut down, they get beat down because for a lot of different reasons. Mainly because they don't have a good plan of attack. They're, tr they're, they're trying to take too much on at one time and, and, and they don't know what they're up against and they're just getting beat down. They really aren't, but they're just getting overwhelmed and it's like, fuck it, I'm out, man. It's too much for me. The things that you are doing today are getting you ready for tomorrow. It's exciting. You know that you're getting closer every day. Ambition must be kept alive, be kept active, must continue to move forward. Otherwise, you're just daydreaming. You must keep active, keep moving forward so your ambition can fuel you, motivate you, get you where you want to be. Success is challenging to get, fleeting once you've attained it. Uh, I think you should never take it for granted. Never should you take success for granted. Mediocrity is the norm. Spotting possibilities where others are looking for problems. Don't let other people set your expectations of yourself. So what do you do when you fall down? Get back up. Everybody knows to get back up. There are some things in life that are out of your control that you can't change and you got to live with. The choice that we have though is either to give up or keep on going. As dark as it gets, keep going. As difficult as it gets, as much as it seems as if the world is crumbling down around you and there's no way out, keep fucking going. If you're unsure about who you are, then your dreams, your goals, they will never become a reality. Everyone has mental doubts in life, internal conflicts. Even the most successful people that you look up to, but they don't live there. It's how you handle those negative thoughts in that exact moment and overwhelm them with positive action. And that comes with this utmost confidence in yourself that you can handle the situation. Trust in yourself that you are better than the moment. Success is something that has to be earned and re-earned. The world is a dynamic place. The world is changing. If you're not changing along with it, you're probably being left behind. Most people think that safety and security is some sort of magical heaven that they could land in if only they got that job that, in the regular paycheck. Do you see how unstable that actually is? Because companies come and go, rise and collapse, people get laid off, and your life was always in another man's hands. The most stable thing that a man can do is to listen to his heart and to follow it. And it's up to you to find meaning in your work, whether you're a street sweeper, whether you're a police officer, whether you're a teacher, whether you're an astronaut, whether you're an entrepreneur, to find the meaning in your work so that every day you feel like you're on a mission.
But when you think about the quality of people's lives, it starts with the, what meaning we give things. Uh, two people can have the same exact experience and one person thinks it's over and one person thinks the game has begun. And that is the difference that makes the difference in the quality of people's lives. It's not what happens to them as we all know.